Good morning, folks. How are all you toy collectors and enthusiasts doing this morning? It's Monday morning for me, 9 a.m. Four minutes till 9 a.m. My uh, work shift's about to start for 24 hours. And uh, no guarantees that I might, I may or may not be able to get out and check out some stores, look for some clearances, look for some vintage. But I really hope that I do. <laughs> As always, I'll be working with the Walmart Rambler, and uh, we'll see what we get into. We'll get into some trouble for you guys today somehow, some way. Keep coming up with Funky at like every single day. So any hoot, guys, uh, this is just a morning howdy to you all. Hope you'll have a wonderful morning, and I'll see you out there on the hunt. Peace. <laughs>
Hmm, it's another really big junk bag of toys. Bunch of cheap little plastic toys in here. bus guys see you at the next one all right guys so next stop is going to be in my local walgreens uh hasn't been anything good here really in a long long time but you never know what's going to pop in so let's run in and take a quick quick look and then we'll get on our way peace yep the usual suspects all the same pig warmers nothing as usual They haven't got pops here in a year. All right, folks. I'm going to go ahead and bump out of here and I'll see you when I see you. Y'all have a good day. All right, so my next stop is going to be GameStop. Uh, just going in to look for the clearance items, maybe uh, action figures, see if they have anything new as far as Super Mario. Uh, pops, the only pops I'm really looking for is going to be either Chase's or Rick and Morty. Uh, that's about all I need. So let's go ahead and run in and take a quick look. Three for 30 isn't bad, and they are stacked with pops. Kind of like that Sonic the Hedgehog and some of these uh, game pops. Pretty cool. I know Walmart Rambler are looking for all these bendies, and they have all of them right now, the whole wave. They have a ton of these action figures also. They're all looking pretty good. A little pricey for me, but I love them all. Let's see what this clearance stuff looks like. It's a pretty good deal right now. Alrighty, guys and gals. We're going to get down to Cody's real quick and uh, take a look at the vintage scene. Looking for some vintage loose if possible. Or just anything cool. So let's go ahead and run down. See you inside. Okay, what do you see? Here? Look at this over here. Look at this. I saw this last time. Snoopy. You like the Snoop? No, not that Snoop. Look at that. A shower radio. Always wanted one of those. Right? Always wanted a shower radio. I thought that was the coolest thing ever. I know. Some of those for four. Good morning, folks. So, as you saw, 
Uh, I ran into several, several stores here around town in a one out of town after a call. Uh, I didn't really pick anything up. There's, I'm budgeting. I do have money to spend, but I really, right now, I want to love what I see, as my buddy David always tells me. Buy what you love, not what you like. <laughs> so I'm trying to behave. But so that I don't go empty-handed on this video, I have uh, two packages in from eBay, and they're both vintage. Some brand new, some used, but they're very vintage 80s, 90s figs. And I want to share them with you real quick. I'm super excited. I've been waiting on these for a while. So I got my handy dandy knife and we're going to carve these open and check them out. Let's do this little package first. All right. First one. That's <laughs> still sweet like. This is an eBay bid that I won for I'll have to check. I think like four or something maybe, five bucks. But if I'm wrong, I'll post it. <laughs> and this is a complete figure. Very excited to get him. This is 1983 Jitsu. A little loose let's see how he, he stands very well i already have uh fisto so fisto and jitsu it's kind of two that you want to get this one comes complete with his armor which i love getting the chest plate both sides and he comes with his sword which you can see someone chewed on really bad but at least the sword is packaged with it he has a kung fu chop and this uh action works very well on him so super stoked to grab jitsu he looks really good paint looks good a little bit on the hair needs touch up but i like him as is actually his feet his legs are actually really tight he's in good shape i'll give him one a give him like a seven on a scale of one to ten but jitsu is awesome with sword so happy to land this one Jitsu 83 Masters of the Universe. So very dope. Very dope. All right. Next package. This is the big one I've been waiting for. first one this is gonna be 91 Marvel toy biz as you can see the cards are kind of a little warped but this is powerlifting action Colossus this is on card so even though the cards a little warped I love it 91 Colossus and he comes with that big old weight bar to work out with he has an action so super stoked to land him. That's a good looking card. Very good looking. All right, let's go ahead with the next. The next one looks like to be in even better shape. Yeah, it's old. Okay, this one is a 95. 95 X-Men X-Force the Blob. You can see he looks really good on card. The card is in way better shape than Colossus. But uh, super stoked to land this big guy. I probably won't ever open this one. I love the jet there. One day maybe I'll get that. The Sentinel looks great. And there's the actual uh, wave that he comes with. All amazing. So this is going to be my home all together, guys. Colossus. Uncanny Colossus. And then we got the Blob. X-Force Blob. We got Jitsu. So this is gonna be my haul guys for today. 
This is the tattoo toy hunter, reminding you to never give up that hunt. Y'all take care. Yeah.